Hello, serious people. It is me, Elliot, chilling in my house. Woo! Sorry, that was just, um, I'm really bored right now, as you can tell. I'm pretty sure everyone is, but, you know, we, we may do with what we got. Uh, anyways, hope you guys are all good. Hope you're all staying inside, following the guidelines, following, um, protecting the NHS. And listen, don't you dare go out. I don't know you want to just... Go and trot outside and go and see your friends and see, you know, loved ones. I know it's hard for some people, but hey, if we all get through this together and we all stay inside, it'll all be over soon. It'll all be over quicker if we all just stay inside. So please, stay inside. Thank you. Anyways, uh, as you can tell, um, glasses. I'm a little bit different. Uh, I think we all are, because I watched Oscars, and uh, yeah, I feel like we're all going to be changing. By the time we get back, we're all just going to look completely different. <laughs> Currently, at this date, we are still in lockdown, uh, and I'm here to talk about uh, how it's been going for me. Um, when it first started, I was not okay, mainly because like it was, it was the build-up of it. And like, it was becoming more and more real. I think it was for everyone, it was slowly, slowly becoming more real. For me, it became most real when everyone kept talking about it, firstly, and like, nothing else. Secondly, when, you know, other countries were doing stuff, like Italy. And then thirdly, when they finally shut down every school, that was like the last straw. And I was like, okay, this is this fun hit. Like, this is real. We have got to like, this is something that's probably like gonna be so significant in our lifetimes, you know? And to everyone's lifetimes, young, old, you know, it affects everyone, it's insane. But now we're inside. And so now I'm gonna talk to you about what I've been up to uh, during this all. Firstly, just like everyone else. I'm kind of just a little bit bored. I want to go see my friends and family. But hey, what can you do? I've been trying to keep myself occupied by doing a couple things which I'm going to tell you now. Number one. I have started my own YouTube channel. And, you know, I've been trying to be funny. Uh, I'm just trying to keep myself entertained. I also want to become... You know, I want to go and do something in the industry, so I want to become, like, be an editor or be a cameraman, you know? So I'm practicing my skills of editing, like, ready? Bang! Boo! <laughs> Look at that! That's crazy, ready? Boom! Yeah, that's bright, you better subscribe! Uh, <laughs> oh, sorry about that, I'm in a really weird mood today. Uh, which is good, because I'm a little bit hyper. Way! I made a YouTube. Uh, I've also started a podcast on there. I really wanted to start, um, this isolation time is really good time to start doing stuff that you've been holding off for doing for a long time. Because I've always wanted to start a YouTube channel and Sirius TV has always given me, is now giving me the confidence to actually do that because I don't think I'd be as good at the YouTube stuff if it wasn't for Sirius TV, so. Thank you guys, you're amazing. Uh, and I've always wanted to do a podcast. I've just never, like, really had the time to because of GCSEs, but hey. I mean, screw me, right? I don't need to do that anymore. Way no exams for this guy. He's just got to... Fingers crossed and just hope he can get through it all. <laughs> yeah, so podcast, YouTube. Uh, those are the two things that I, like, keep my schedule up. Because I, the one thing I miss about school, because I don't really miss school at all. Because, you know, it's just, oh, it's just the worst. But, you know, there was some positive to it, mainly the only factor. When I was talking to my podcast, I always asked the question, do you miss school? They always reply with no, but I do miss my friends. I think it's because if we weren't in isolation right now, I think everyone would just not miss school. Because, you know, school sucks. But the one thing I do miss about school is the scheduling. You know, knowing that, I, okay, I've got to do this, i got to do that, and then the day is done. But then I hate it when I just sit inside watching like films or Netflix or YouTube and I'm like, I'm not doing anything productive. I need to do something productive now. Otherwise, I'm gonna freak out. Yeah, I'm like that. So I need to do something. So having the YouTube, having to do it daily, at least gives me that like kills like a couple hours doing that. So it's it's good to do that and like just um you know keep my scheduling up and at least saying hey I did something productive today. So that's why I like that. I've been doing other projects that I've also been holding off, such as uh, I've got this, look at this. It's a serious uh, badge, which I can stick on stuff. So I'm gonna go stick this on a sweatshirt eventually. Um, 
Next, I also have some shirt designs that I've been working on. Uh, I'll probably pop them up on the screen now. Uh, I, I'm very happy with how they turned out. I just want to, you know, work on them a bit more and I want to actually like see what goes into making a shirt and what can like almost like running a business it's almost like yeah it's really weird but yeah I'd like to do that uh, I've also been doing rather big projects like I did on my YouTube I did a massive 45 minute long video of my entire years of high school the highest peaks the lowest peaks really to show like that there is a lot of flaws to me who made me me but now I am happy with who I am and I've accepted it all and I'm just an amazing individual I feel because I've just stopped caring about things and I feel like that's what makes me you know I feel like as soon as you stop caring what other people feel and focus just on yourself you become a way better person maybe not like focus on yourself like don't care about anyone else you should care about other people but like if people judge you you shouldn't care about that that's what I'm trying to say here I hope that you all are okay I hope that you all are uh, taking care of yourselves and your families I hope that they're not driving you insane because some days you know my mind just explodes with some of the stuff that like my whole entire family does but hey you know it is what it is but it will, it will get better eventually. Uh, I hope the rest of the series guys are okay. Uh, it looks like it. Um, you know, dyeing your hair is always a positive, so good job, Oscar. <laughs> Keep doing that. Uh, um, I hope everyone's, yeah, I just honestly hope everyone's okay, just because this is such a strange time we live in, and it's definitely a part of history, and I mean, every bit's a part of history, but this is a significant part of history, and it's insane to think about like too deeply, which I'm not going to do because otherwise, you know, I'll get like an existential crisis. So let's not do that. No, I've literally um, tried to keep myself from being bored, not being bored. So literally, name a hobby, I've done it. Uh, graphics design, art, uh, music, uh, videos. Um, I'm going to do painting soon. Uh, I want to make a shirt soon. Like literally anything, I've probably done it. <laughs> badminton, I do badminton outside. Yeah. Yeah, it's insane. Um, firstly, for me, it's really weird, but I don't go outside just because of the. I, I everyone goes outside to like calm down. Unfortunately, I live in a place where like there's so many people around. I get so worried that I'm interrupting someone else, and I'm like, okay. okay I need to be on this side of the wall, otherwise I might interrupt them, and then and then what if like what if they get scared or what if it's poor lady? So I just don't go outside now because it just like it's it's so. My like my anxiety just rockets when I go outside, so that's a no-go to me. Another thing that's been keeping me sane throughout this entire experience is um, the factor of this one little game that I've been playing for like over 150 hours now um, since the start of quarantine. That's right, baby. Animal Crossing. I've been day in, day out playing that game. And if you know how, if you know that game, you know that game. And yeah, it's been insane. And it's been so, you know, I don't have many friends who play it, so like, I just sound so weird because I'm just going to my friends. I'm like, listen, right, I've got like 600 turnips, so I need to sell the turnips when the stock market rises during the week because otherwise then the turnips will spoil it by the next Sunday, so I need to spend them all right now, otherwise I'll lose all my money because I invested all my. Yeah, I malfunction pretty much if I talk about Animal Crossing for too long. But yeah, it's a cute game. I love it. Anyways, uh, I've been yapping on for too long now, probably. It's been uh, Elliot. I'm signing off now. Laters, geeks. <gasps> Hope you all do well, and uh, we'll catch up soon, I guess. Woo! <laughs> Nobody saw that.